I want to live an extraordinary life. I want to live a life that I could have never dreamed of. I don't want to be limited by my own weaknesses, but I want to rely on your strength. Like if you're sitting in the room today and if you say, I want to experience what this man is talking about. You need to give your life to Jesus and I believe he's moving on your heart in this moment to do just that. So if you're sitting in the room today and if you want to surrender your life to Jesus, I'm going to count to three. When I count to three, I'd like you to raise your hand wherever you're seated. All right, with every eye closed, with every head bowed. If you want to surrender your life to Jesus, on the count of three, just raise your hand. One, two, three. Three, just go ahead, raise your hand. All right, bless you, bless you, bless you in the back. Can you keep them high up, please? All right, bless you, bless you over there. All right. For those of you that raised your hand, you can put it down. We're going to pray a prayer together right now. After I pray this prayer with you, you're going to be what the Bible calls a new creation. Your sins will be forgiven. After you place your faith in Jesus, you begin to start that new life. You may not understand everything about it right now, but you'll grow to understand it. You'll grow in not only knowledge, but you'll grow in experience of God's love. So I'm going to pray this prayer and I'd like you to repeat after me. Let's pray together. Dear Jesus, I come to you today and I surrender my life to you. Fill me with your spirit. Forgive me of my sins. From this day forward, make me born again. Make me a new creation. Give me a new beginning. In your name I pray. Amen. Amen. Let's give the Lord a hand for what he's done. Let's give the Lord a hand for what he's done.